This is a 1972 Honda CB175. Manufacture date is 2 of 72. The serial number is CB175-701-7248. Thirteen thousand one hundred and twenty two miles. The odometer does work. The tachometer, we're waiting for a cable. The cable has been ordered. Inside of the tank has been treated. It's pretty much rust free and we've flushed it out a few times. You may want to coat the inside of the tank. Right side of the tank, nice shape. Left side of the tank. There's a repair right there, and you can see some damage right there on the tank. A little bit of a push in right there. Front fender chrome, pretty nice shape. No major dings of any kind. Yeah, original cables, it's got the double leading shoe front brake like it should. It's got a Dunlop K70 in the front, nice shape. No dry rotting that we can see should be good to go. Forks, nice condition. Headlight works, high beam, low beam. Signals, original, work. The headlight ears are kind of a funny color, not sure why. Were they chrome and then got repainted? Not entirely sure. All the, con all the controls are original, all the cables are original, that we can tell. The throttle cable might have been replaced because it's got that plastic end on it right there. Not 100% sure. Pipes, right side pipe, nice original condition. Left side pipe, got no major dings or anything, but it does have some rust through right on the end there. Doesn't seem to affect the performance or the amount of noise it makes. On both the front and the rear, there's a pair of fairly rare Preston Petty Utter Mudders. They'll come with the bike. The vintage plates do not come with the bike. Again, another Dunlop K70 in the rear. Nice shape, no dry rotting that I can find. Cane and sprock, in nice shape, no play. Wheel spins freely, no play in the axle, no play in the swing arm. Side covers. As you can see, the CB175 emblem has been replaced by a reflector. Left side cover is in nice shape. Right side cover has some damage to it, as you can see. Should be available on eBay. Electric start and kickstart work. Carburetors clean, spotless inside. And the seat, you can see the Honda emblem, the seat strap is original, it's got some damage right here. Seat covers are readily available from a number of sources. The uh, luggage rack is a AAA luggage rack, it's in nice shape, it's been, chrome is in good shape, it looks like it's the right rack for the bike. A little bit of bubbling on the rear fender under the taillight. But uh, you can probably find a fender on eBay if you're patient. Under the seat, nice condition. I forget if the manual's under there. No, it's not. Okay, uh, there are some uh, tools in the toolbox, just a couple. It will have a brand new battery when it's sold. It will also have a replacement tack cable. Okay, we're going to hook the battery up and start it. So 
Well, there you have it, 1972 CB175 Honda, nice original bike, make a nice rider or a nice basis for a restoration.